you guys welcome back to my channel and today's video is a collab with my favorite favorite youtuber Brianna Marie of course and we did a collab on this look halo eyes so don't forget to go check out her channel it will be linked in the description box so go watch her video on her take of her halo eyes but if you'd like to see how i got my halo eyes keep on watching okay you guys so i am priming my eyes with la girls pro conceal in the shade fawn and i'm applying that all over my eyes and i'll be using my finger to blend that out Now setting my concealer with translucent powder from Airspun, I think. Um, and I'm using that on a Real Technique setting brush. Now going in with my BH Cosmetics Second Edition 120 palette, and I'm taking that pink shade as a translucent. Ugh translucent shade what am I saying a transition shade I'm applying that all over my crease and a little above my crease and also on the outer V and inner corners of my eye as I will be doing a halo eye and you kind of have to get the eyeshadows that you're using all over the eye now uh, going in with that purple shade it is the third shade on the right side of the palette from that pink and i am just applying that to my crease and the inner corners and the outer v of my eyelids Now to darken up my crease, I am going in with a darker purple, this is more of a violet shade I guess, and I'm applying that in the same areas as before, my crease, my outer and inner corners of my eyes. Beach Cosmetics Blending Brush Going in with a denser blending brush This is the Morphe G13 brush And I'm using that just to blend out the edges of all those shades Now to create that halo I'm using the LA Girl Pro Conceal Concealer and the shade Fawn just to create a blank canvas for that halo shade or the brighter shade that's going to create the halo eye. Using this Mary Kay at Play uh, eyeshadow 3O 
trio or whatever they want to call it and i think this is i forgot the name of this but all the products will be listed and i'm just applying the lightest color in that palette on the center of my lips to give that halo effect now i am taking the morphe b i i think it's b 14 or something like that don't quote me on that and i'm just using that to blend out the edges of that halo eye now going in with brunette from morphe's 3502 palette y'all know i can't do a makeup look and don't use this palette like i legit use this palette in every single makeup look but anywho using that to darken up the inner and outer corners of my eyes now just reapplying a little more of that bright shade as a lot of the blending kind of took away from it and just to blend out the edges now taking the gold highlighter color from the absolute new york highlight and contour palette y'all don't want to forget the name of this palette right but you should know it by now i listed it in every video but yeah i'm just applying that with a flat shader brush and using my blending brush to blend that out now i'm just cleaning off my face with makeup wipes just to get rid of that fallout shadow Now taking Mary Kay's foundation primer and I'm applying that all over my face pretty much just to prepare for my foundation and to ensure my foundation lasts all day. Going in with Mary Kay's Liquid Foundation, matte, this is in matte wear, and this is in the shade Bronze 4, and I am applying that with a Real Techniques Buffing Brush, and I'm using that basically to buff it into my skin, just as the brush is called. Going back in with that LA Girl Pro Conceal in the shade Fawn, and I am applying that to my highlighted areas, my under eyes, my cupid's bill, my forehead, and my chin.
now to contour i am applying mary Kay's cream to powder foundation this is in the shade bronze 2 and i am taking that on my jaw i presume my forehead my nose and under my jaw wait no my cheekbones and my jawline i always get those names wrong but yeah, I don't know what I'm talking about. Now to blend out the concealer, I am using a real, no, a Sephora con foundation brush. And I'm just basically patting the concealer I am not wiping it as if you wipe it you pretty much wipe off the product Now I'm going in with a damp beauty blender. I'm just using that to blend out my contour and also to blend it into the highlight. going in with a beach cosmetic small contour brush just to blend out that contour a little more air sponge powder y'all don't quote me on the names on these stuff like 
I am half asleep right now and I just had to get this video out but yeah I'm just using that to set the highlighted areas and now I'm going back in with my highlight and contour palette from Absolute New York again don't quote me on the name and I'm taking the darkest contour shade in that palette just to set the contoured areas using a Sephora powder brush just to blend wait no I'm setting the rest of my face with my Mary Kay uh, mineral setting powder this is in the shade bronze too now taking a black eyeliner pencil this is from black radiance and i'm just using that to line my lower waterline Now for the lower lash line, I am first going to apply the transition shade, which is the pink shade from the BH Cosmetics 120 palette, and also the two purple shades that I use on my eyelids. applying mascara to my lower lashes and the name of all the products I use in this video will be listed in the description box Going back in with that strobing and contour palette from Absolute New York, I am taking the gold shade in that palette on a wet black eyeshadow brush just to apply that to my inner tear duct. Well, is it my tear duct? Well, I don't know what I mean. I don't like, I ain't no pro, I don't know all the names. I'm just telling you guys what I do. Now for blush, I am taking a Mary Kay blush and highlight dual palette. 
And this is in the shade Guava. And I am using a uh, Beast Cosmetic Blush Brush to apply shade to my cheekbones. Now taking a Girl Technique Fan Brush, also using the highlight shade in that palette to highlight my cheekbones, the bridge of my nose, my forehead, and my chin, and also my cheek fill. That is good. Like, I really did not expect to see this highlighter glow this much. Like, it just amazed me. when I apply my lip color. Like I said, for the trillion time, everything will be in the sale in the description box. for this video guys and I'll catch you in the next one y'all don't mind my dancing like I was watching the Grammys and Despacito was playing honey but thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one bye dolls